Hey guys, JC here, playing Fahrenheit. We are going to go now to Lucas's apartment. Phone. Coming, coming. I'm coming. Lucas Kane. No, 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 no. Oh, crap. Oh, damn it. Oh, crap. Get ready. Stop messing up my apartment. Crap. Go, 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 go. Come on. You can do this. You can do this. You can do this. You gotta be freaking kidding me. You gotta be freaking kidding me, man. Oh, damn it. How am I supposed to survive this? Run, 
Lucas's terrifying story haunted oh. me all night long. I had to see him, to talk to him. I had to find out what Agatha had told him. I wanted to look my brother in the eye and hear the truth. I'd never been to his apartment before, and it took me some time to find it. Oh, crap. Come on. Lucas Kane. That's it. <laughs> Just enter, man. Just enter. Oh, crap. <laughs> Come on. Come on. You can do Lucas? this. Lucas? Lucas, open the door. Lucas! Come on. I could swear that I heard a scream coming from inside. The doorman said Lucas was at home, but he isn't opening. Break the Lucas damn door. I've got no other choice. Come on. Good. The balcony, the balcony. Come on. He's back there. Oh, there. Lucas! Oh my god! Come on, man. Come on. Got you, bro. Come on. Oh. Oh. Lucas, for God's sake. Have you lost your mind? What's come over you? The walls. The walls were blown away. And the wind. The tempest. I... Why did you do this, Lucas? Why? Somebody tried to kill me. For heaven's sake, Lucas. There's no one else here but you and I. You were all alone when I arrived. All alone, Lucas. What's happening to me, Marcus? I don't know what's happening. You're going It'll bananas. Be all right, Lucas. Everything will be fine. I'm going to help you. You'll see. Yeah. Thanks, bro. Appreciate it. Timmy scene. Okay, so Carlos taking a shower. Whoa, looking hot, babe. Where's the phone? I think it's ringing right here. I don't see it. Oh, there it is. Come on, answer. Sure took your time. I was in the shower. What do you got? I got nothing. Dead end. Impossible to ID the page marker found in the book from the restaurant. It's got a series of numeric codes written on it, but it just looks like a lot of numbers to me. I, I thought you might have some ideas. Why don't you fax it to me? I wasn't tired anyway. I'm sure it'll make for good bedtime reading. Okay, I'll send it now. If you get any brainstorms, give me a ring. I'll be here for a while. Tonight's gonna be a long one. Okay, talk to you later, Tyler. Whoa. Um. <laughs> nice. Okay, so let's explore a bit. What is this? Oh, toilet. Oh, she needed to pee. Okay, good. Um, let me just see back here in the bathroom. 
there is anything. Okay. Oh, bonus. Always good to have bonuses. Here. Okay, maybe clothes. Am I getting dressed? I think I am getting dressed. Oh, that was stupid. No, take your clothes off. That's better. Okay. So, the bed, some stuffed animals. <laughs> okay. TV, balcony. Can I look here? I haven't had such a cold winter in ages. I hate winter. Everything is silent, motionless, as if everything was dead. Hope it doesn't last long. Mm hmm What? He, what? What was that? Oh, there's a guy coming. How could that be at this hour? I'm not expecting anyone. So, can I open like this? Uh, that's the door. I can't open the door dressed like this. Yeah. Damn it. I'm gonna have to go and put some clothes on. That's... That's really bad. Okay. Yeah, I'm coming. Damn it. You know, as soon as that guy is out of here, I'm undressing again. Yeah, I'm coming. Easy, easy. Coming, coming. Okay. Who the I was hell? I'm kind of bored and thought, as my official friendly neighbor, you'd agree to share my boredom and this excellent bottle of French Chablis. In my capacity as your friendly neighbor, I wouldn't think of refusing your boring invitation or your excellent wine, Tommy. Ugh. I imagine that even a die-hard bachelorette like yourself must have some wine glasses around here somewhere. Hmm. I think I do have some. Somewhere. Sit down, Tommy. I'll find them. Hmm. Okay. Where's the information Tyler was going to send? I need to find the glasses now. Nope. Cans. Uh, nope. What about here? Nope. Ugh. Wait a second. There we go. Okay. So now... What are we going to do with this guy? There. Okay, I'm gonna sit. What's up, man? You trying to get me drunk? A toast? All right. What to? To love. What else? I'll drink to that. Okay. 
Cheers. So, Tommy. Are you with anyone? Well, actually, I did meet someone two weeks ago. He's very real and very nice. And he works in a bank, too. Key. I think this time it could turn into something serious. Oh. I see. So... Are you still single? What's a beautiful girl like you waiting for? Go find yourself a nice guy. If there's one thing New York has lots of, it's handsome men. I don't know. I guess the desire is just not there. Okay. My last romantic experiences were total disasters. I'm not ready for anything. Or anyone, just yet. Um, difference? I'm happy to see you got your smile back. We all have our ups and downs, right? I always thought that people in New York didn't give a damn about gayness. They were so enlightened. How wrong I was. They still look at us as being different from so-called normal folks. And not small talk. Look at what I brought. What? Tarot cards? I'm going to read your future. <laughs> you mean you know how to use those things? My grandmother was a psychic. She taught me how to read the cards when I was just a kid. Oh. She handed down her seeing powers to me. It really works, you know. What the cards foretell always come to pass. Let's see if you're going to meet your true soulmate or if you're going to die as a wrinkled old maid. <laughs> okay, Mr. Gypsy. Tell me what I'm supposed to do. It's easy. First take the cards and mix them up. Okay. Take two cards. Two cards. Use the character control keys to move your hand. Use the enter key to choose a card. Okay. Uh, so that one. And this one. There's going to be a dark period, an escape. Terrible danger. Take two more cards. Yeah, this is stressing me out. I'm gonna take that one. And I'm gonna take this one. You're not alone. You're following someone and he is... disturbing. He hides a heavy secret. Take two more cards, please. Yeah. Again with the cards. Okay, that one, and this one. There is a curse, great suffering and fear. I see dark death and distress. Yes, just come to me whenever you need cheering up. Seriously, I'm sorry, Carla. This is not turning out to be as much fun as I thought. Mm. It's okay, Tommy. Let's see what horrors my destiny holds for me. Here are two more cards. This one. And that one. One child. Two destinies. A path toward life. The other path toward death. Carla, I think we'll stop there. I'm, I'm sorry, I don't know what happened. It's the first time I've ever read this sort of thing in the cards. Usually don't express anything like this. Don't apologize, Tommy. It's just a silly game. I never believed in fortune telling anyway. Well, I've got to get home. It's late. Good night, Carla. Good night, Tommy. It was real nice talking. Don't wait so long next time, okay? I promise. Mm. That was disturbing. 
Let me see if Tyler sends something. Future that grim? You mentioned a child. I don't believe in this stuff, but it's always a little scary, whatever you think of it. Yes, it is. Mm, what? What can I do now? Destruction and creation are the same thing after all. 